you had that reverse dunk that might have gotten this arena louder than it got for any dunk all weekend long. What what would it take to get you in the dunk contest? Nothing. <laughs> Just if I want to, I will. Other than that, nah. No, that's why I ain't been in it yet. <laughs> The answer might change, I don't know, but as of now, nah. The goal's not high enough. Okay, before I kick it to you, Stephen A., we'd all love to see John the dunk contest, right? One of the best in-game dunkers. Props to New York's own Obi Toppin, who won it. But I understand, Mr. Smith, you are not satisfied with the state of the dunk contest. So please propose to us how one would fix the dunk uh, contest uh, and bring it back to hold a on, Molly. days. Oh, yeah, I, go ahead. I, I, let me sit uh, hold back. on, hold, let me hold, sit hold back. on, hold on. Let me Kendrick Perkins, I'm glad, I'm glad that you are on this segment with me because I want to look at you when I say this to a national television audience. That was the worst slam dunk contest in the history of basketball. It was a national atrocity. It was awful. <laughs> Somebody need to say it, so I'm going to say it. Now, I'm happy that a Nick won something. We actually had a New York Nick that won something. <laughs> that was Obi Coppin, okay? <laughs> um, it was so bad. It was so bad. It's one of the rare moments that I think we should actually hide a trophy. We should actually hide the trophy. That's how bad it was. Um, I would like Adam Silver... Uh, Mark Tatum, Tim Frank, and everybody else I know at the NBA office to know to expect a call from me. This week's holiday today, but expect a call from me this week because I'm dead serious. I don't blame y'all for laughing, but I'm dead serious. They're going to hear from me. We cannot have, we cannot have this atrocity showing up on a Saturday night for NBA All-Star Weekend. It was a national embarrassment. I listen. I'm fit. Here's, here's what I put in perspective. Here's what I put in perspective. I'm 54 years old. I struggled, Kendrick Perkins, with bad knees. And guess what? I could have missed that many dunks. I mean, you ain't do anything I didn't do. I couldn't do. Who can't miss dunks all the damn time? And if listen, if you OB topping, I saw you do it in the game, but somehow you missed. Um, you Toscano Anderson, <laughs> when the hell did you dunk like that before? I heard that you don't do that in practice. How the hell are you going to do it at a slam dunk contest? Cole Anthony, major love for him and promise. I love his game. I love all of their games. They got and Jalen Green. I love all of their potential. I'm not knocking them as players or anything like that. But you call Anthony, you're not a dunker. So if you're going to dunk, what the hell are you doing putting on Timberlands for? I love your daddy. He's a friend of mine. He going to get a call from me, too. What the hell was that? What, the Timberlands? Really? I mean, you got to be kidding me. So here's my proposal. Here's my proposal, KP. It's just the truth. It's just the truth, man. I mean, somebody got to say it. Somebody got to say it, damn it. Now, KP, look up in the camera because I got an idea for you. And this is dead serious. <laughs> I'm dead serious about this. Are you ready for this idea, KP? <laughs> KP, you and I both know we could go to any park in America and see these cats dunking. We got <clears> cats <throat> in the streets <clears throat> that wasn't blessed and fortunate enough to be associated with organized basketball in a fashion that would enable them to be in the NBA. But these brothers can play. And obviously the mm -hmm. NBA got money. I am proposing on national television a national slam dunk tournament nationwide all throughout the cities throughout America. And we find, based on that competition, the top 10 dunkers, okay? And then ultimately you find like five to seven of them, pick the best five to seven of them based on the slam dunk competitions we win we witness, rather, and we get the NBA players to sponsor. I'm not talking about monetarily, but I'm talking about to support out of those seven, which ones they want to pick or what have you. You keep the players involved, but they don't have to participate yeah. in the dunk contest. We get cats off the streets 
off the streets in the park, Rutgers Park. You could go to the West Side. You in Chicago. You could go someplace in South in South Central LA or somewhere Long Beach. It could be anywhere. Nationwide competition. I promise you, Molly. And Kendrick Perkins knows I'm telling the truth. You see brothers in the park, yeah. in the streets, that can dunk and put on an absolute show and let them get sponsored mm -hmm. by their favorite all-star. The winner gets a million. The runner-up gets 500000 The consolation third prize gets $100,000, okay? And if you want to mix up some of those funds to throw it to an all-star's favorite charity or whatever, you do it. But we got to get cats who can put on a show in the dunk contest. Yeah. Because what we witnessed Saturday night was a national <laughs> atrocity. It was the worst slam dunk contest in the history of basketball. <laughs> Notice I didn't say the NBA. It could have been the CBA. It could have been the park. It could have been it. I have never seen a slam dunk contest that bad. That bad. It was that. I literally, and you know how I am about the cold weather. I literally left and walked outside in the cold and said, I'm done with this. God, it was horrible. It was horrible. Go ahead, KP. You, I, look, you, hey, you Steven, want me to like, go? I, you go. I, I, go ahead. Go, look, I'm all in for your idea, man. I think that's a wonderful idea because the fact of the matter is, man, you got to get people who are hungry. You got to get people that really want to do it. Their hearts got to be into it. And you're right. It's guys around the world that's around the country that's not in the NBA that are that is athletic as hell and would will come in and absolutely put on the show. To be honest, this is the best idea I, I've heard as far as correcting the dunk contest because everything you just said, I wanted to come over here and say the same thing, but I didn't know you was going to take it this far. But you're absolutely right. It was horrible. And look, we have to clean up this dunk contest because it means so much. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.